Hi everyone and welcome to the video. Today we're going to be looking at the Xiaomi Mi Drone. Now this is a new product release um, by the Xiaomi company. You probably know them better for their smartphones. Probably number three company in China. Um, just under Samsung. Some of the specs are better on the Samsung 7 apparently. Let's take a look at the drone. Well, I was quite impressed um, with this drone. Um, the pricing is unbelievable you're talking about a product release of four hundred and fifty dollars for a 4k drone <laughs> that's what I thought now with anything that comes from China especially their cameras I was very skeptical uh, so many times I've seen 4k put onto their cameras and in fact they're not 4k at all but currently they're uh, giving out the 180p version which prices are an unbelievable in UK sterling is 280 pounds which is fantastic it has a one kilometer uh, distance for FPV um, apparently 720p goes back to the controller which is quite impressive the 4k version which will be available in July is 350 pounds oh, that's not oh, no, 480 dollars which is nothing okay I've done a bit of research I've looked at the big long unboxing by um, the company and unfortunately the American actor or whatever he was presenter he didn't really have the information to give on the drone and he had to rely on the people behind the cameras to give him information so I didn't find his video very helpful and pretty unprofessional for a product launch but there you go um, some of the big points that stood out to me was the camera and god does it look like a CGO2 from a unique quadcopter there you can see it there apparently it has a Sony sensor which was quite impressive and I think it's a seven lens system um, to combat lens distortion from wide angle lens um, we're gonna go into that in a minute I don't think the camera is gonna be up to the mark but for the price range um, as an entry level quadcopter I think it's fantastic the unfortunate thing is the camera um, this is the big selling point I'd rather them put hundred dollars on and improve the camera and I'm gonna show you a few videos um, of the footage from uh, YouTube which I've found trying to find an English review is very difficult out there okay on the launch video they show some clips uh, they went around the world filming with the um, me drone and it's quite impressive but it's very quick cut in they didn't really spend a lot of time doing any kind of orbits or anything it seems to be straight cuts and uh, it's more than likely in post-production they've made any corrections to fisheye lens because the, the horizon looks beautiful I was quite impressed I thought 
a drone for 350 quid I'm gonna try one of these I'm gonna buy one but before I buy anything it's always worth looking on the net for examples of the footage and this is where the problem began now some of the product reviewers in China um, I think it's Sam Sammy Lu I hope I pronounced his name correctly you'll find links in the description below if you want to watch any of his videos he's been testing this and apparently he's got a good reputation as a product reviewer now he's been posting a few videos I don't know if it's down to lack of pilot experience or whether he's not done firmware updates on the gimbal um, but some of his footage is quite impressive and here's a couple of clips I can't show too much and immediately what stood out to me was fish eye lens and oh, I was so disappointed um, the buildings look warped the colors are fantastic the quality seems pretty good and then I looked at more and this is what I found gimbals um, uh, look what can I say about that tilted horizon and what a disappointment but this is pre-product okay so I had to look for the official video and it's only a three hour long video and unfortunately in the official uh, conference video launch conference video we're going to skip through some juddery footage here I'll give you some examples of what's available to view uh, the tilted horizon is evident within their example footage another disappointment if the company is going to release um, its launch video showing tilted horizon I'm a little bit disappointed and a bit wary that they haven't acknowledged there's a problem okay it's a early review um, the products new I guess they're gonna have a few problems and maybe they're gonna address them before the product launch of the 4k which is going out in beta in July hopefully all these little sniggles and with the camera will be addressed um, but I was so disappointed that they've used distorted images and video in their pre-launch conference video I was, I was quite amazed by that but never, nevertheless it comes with some interesting features it has waypoints it's also got orbit although the demonstrations of this are pretty poor as well links below you can view the demonstrations auto return to homes in my opinion was staged um, yeah, the deal breaker for me is the camera however hopefully this will be addressed um, the features seem great where is this product going to go I think if they correct the camera this is a serious contender for DJI and unique the price is right the quality the features are good this sort out the camera and I think this is going to be a big thumbs up from me and I think this company has the power to do it and really make a model a drone model that is competitive with the two leaders out there that are unique and DGI